Hi, I'm Matt, and welcome to this week's episode of Campus Cooks, where we show you that good food can be done on a budget. So this week we're going to do a recipe that I actually stole from my grandmother. Um, she used to make this for me all the time and it's really really simple and it's a great quick lunch or even a quick dinner because uh, only, you only need one pot and you only need a few simple ingredients. So what we're doing is a soup. So it's going to be a chicken broth with some bok choy, some shiitake mushrooms and some rice noodles. So what I have here is some of the baby bok choy we got from the market and the way I've prepared that is just all you want to do is wash it under some cold water, cut the end off, and it just separates out into all the little leaves. And all we're going to do is toss those into the, into the boiling stock. With the shiitake mushrooms, what you want to do is take the stem off, because the stem's really tough and it doesn't cook down. And then all you want to do, you can leave them whole if you prefer. Uh, what I like to do is just give them a slice in half so they're a little bit more manageable to bite into. Uh, so that should be good there. The rice noodles, all I've done is taken them out of the package to start. Uh, you don't want to cook them in the plastic, just for reference. Uh, and we're just going to drop those in and they'll cook in about 30 seconds. So what I've got here is just uh, a box of chicken stock you can get in the little Tetra packs. And all I've done is thrown it in a pot and brought it up to boiling. So just put it on high until it starts bubbling. And then just turn it down to a really, really light simmer. So I've got it on this stove, it's about a four. And this is the dead easy part. All you're going to do is mushrooms in, take the rice noodles, just break them up a bit. We probably don't need all this package. Watch them fly all over the place. And the bok choy, just rip it in half. And you're just going to let that simmer for about four or five minutes until the bok choy is tender, until the mushrooms are tender, and until the, the rice noodles are cooked and then just into a bowl and you can, if, you're, uh, if you want a little more substance, you could throw some chicken in there. If you're vegetarian, you could throw some tofu in there. Um, it's really kind of carte blanche to do anything you want. So we'll just let that cook and we'll come back to it in about four or five minutes. So our soup's ready to go. Now we're just gonna put it in the bowl. So it's had about five minutes simmering on a nice low temperature and you can see the bok choy is kind of wilted and the rice noodles are all nice and soft and the mushrooms have softened and they've also sucked up a lot of the flavor in that broth. So what I'm going to do to plate it is just take my tongs. You could honestly just dump the whole pot in if you want, but I'm going to try and be fancy. Just grab a handful of noodles and just set them in the bottom and just pour everything else over top. And there you go. That's a nice, quick, Asian-style chicken soup. And the stock's already been seasoned, thanks to the people that made it. So we'll see how she tastes. Mmm, bang on. And actually, in about the four or five minutes it's been simmering, some of the flavor from the bok choy and the mushrooms has actually gone into the broth. So you now have a really, really flavorful broth. And it's just that simple. My name's Matt and this is Campus Cooks and we'll see you next week with more fun flared recipes.